Welcome to this video titled Navigating the Bryn Athens Cemetery Part 1. The purpose of this video is to familiarize you with the layout of the Bryn Athens Cemetery. This is the entrance to the cemetery. You can see the parking lot in the distance. It slopes downhill away from you. Here is an aerial photograph of the cemetery that Brent Schnarr created using his drone. You can see that Brent put a pin on every headstone in the cemetery. This should help you in trying to locate the headstone of a loved one should you ever need to do that. A good place for you to start trying to navigate the cemetery would be at the lower end, the downhill end of the parking lot. There is a gravel road more or less straight ahead, another less visible road to the right, and finally the other trail on the left is much more difficult to see. It's only a worn path through the grass. Here is another aerial photograph, this time of those two roads. And here is another photograph of the two roads taken from the lower end, the downhill end of the parking lot. To get to that trail that I mentioned, you'll travel down the road on the left and then turn left through those three cedar trees. Here are the three cedar trees through which you will turn left to proceed down the grass trail. You will head toward that larger evergreen in the distance before swinging toward the left. You should understand that it's really impossible to navigate the Brynathen Cemetery without at least at one point walking across someone's grave. It is really okay. When you start at the downhill end of the parking lot, you can see three choices. A road straight ahead, a road to the right, and the trail to the left. Now, it doesn't matter what I named them, but I named this road the Circle Road because it goes in a big circle around this particular part of the cemetery and ends up back in the uphill end of the parking lot. This other road that branches off to the right and is somewhat less visible I have named the Cross Circle Road for obvious reasons. Now to take the third choice proceed down the road that's straight ahead, turn left through the three cedar trees, and proceed down the worn trail through the grass. It swings around to the left. At the bottom of the trail, you will see two signs and a natural barricade placed there in an attempt to prevent people from using that as a cut through. I have named this trail the Tracks Trail because it is the trail through the cemetery that Brynathen people used to take to get to the tracks and then to the Pennypack Trail. Please watch part two of Navigating the Brynathen Cemetery to learn how to use a new website created by Brent Schnarr that will help you find any particular headstone for which you are looking. 